hello guys welcome to another video tutorial in this video i'm gonna teach with you how you can install eclipse id on windows 10 eclipse is an id which is used to write the codes i'll teach with you how you can install and also how you can create a java project on eclipse id so first thing you need to open your favorite browser and search on that is bar eclipse once you searched the eclipse then you need to open the first one link and click on the download button and also click download 64 bit and finally you need to click on download button then you need to select uh, a location or path as you want to save the project so i'm gonna select our um, location like a download programs and this is my Eclipse ID installer so I'm gonna click start and you need to wait a couple of seconds to download the Eclipse installer on operating system then you will be able to install it on your Windows system right so I'm gonna pause the video after completing the downloading then I will teach with you how you can install it now after completing the downloading uh, Eclipse ID you need to open that and you need to install it on your Windows 10 operating system so you need to wait a couple of seconds to display the installer now guys you need to wait a couple of seconds to display the installer on your screen then you will be able to use the setup to install it on your operating system okay eclipse installer inside eclipse installer have a couple of programming languages that will use inside eclipse id like java developers enterprise java developers c and c plus plus developers PHP developers and many other things so I'm gonna use Eclipse for Java developers so I'm gonna click Java developers now you need to wait a couple of seconds now there are two options the first one is a Java 1.8 plus virtual machine and installation folder where you want to install the Eclipse ID do you want to change that click on the uh, folder button and select your location or path as you want to install it and also you can change the java virtual machine location if you want to change that just click on um, folder button and select your location or path in my case i leave that and i'm going to just click install once you clicked on install then you need to wait a couple of minutes or seconds then you will be able to use Eclipse ID on your operating system so I pause the video after completing the installer I will teach with you how you can create a project on Eclipse ID now you need to select the uh, two check boxes just click on select all and click to accept uh, selected and then wait a couple of seconds to install the Eclipse ID on Windows 10 operating system once you do that then you need to click launch and then you will be able to use Eclipse ID on your operating system I'll teach with you how you can create a project on Eclipse ID and how you can run the Java project on Eclipse ID now where you want to save the projects eclipse project do you want to change that just click on browse button and select your location or path as you want to save the project in my case i leave that and click to launch and then wait a couple of seconds to open the eclipse id to write the codes Now guys this is the interface of Eclipse ID 
I'm gonna use that to create a Java project. So guys, the first thing you need to close that and uh, go to, I mean also leave that and I'm gonna go to new, file new and Java project, right? And uh, select the Java project and enter the project name. Do you want to change that? You can use your own location or path as you want to set the project. If you want to use default, check mark it and enter the project name. In my case, I'm gonna use my demo. This is my project name. Uh, project must, yeah, okay, just a minute. I'm gonna use demo, right? In small characters, right? I use uh, on default location and I'm gonna click to finish to create a Java project. Module name, I'm gonna use same module name. Do you want to change that? You can do that. In my case, I leave that and click to finish. Once you do that, then you're able to see your project has been created with the name of demo. Inside the demo have our two folders. One is JRE system libraries and second one is the SRC. I'm gonna create my class, Java class. So I'm gonna close that. I right click on the folder, our project, go to new and create a class. This is your package name. The default package name is your demo. Enter your class name. For example, I'm gonna use tutorial. This is my class name and do you want to make a class with abstract class? You can check mark it. Do you want to make a class and also include the main method like a public static wired main string args? Just click A and click to finish. Once you do that, then you will be able to use Java on this file. So let's create a simple statement. To display the text first one is a system dot out dot paint right and enter the text for example hello guys we are learning Java programming right said that I'm gonna run this project so I'm gonna click to one as you can see guys we are able to see hello guys we are learning Java programming right and also you can create many classes without a main method for example I'm gonna create a class this is a class and I'm gonna use demo2 this is my class name uh, uppercase okay uppercase I need to use demo to I don't use uh, the public static right I'm gonna create only class this is my second one class the second one class available inside my demo project as you can see demo 2 and this is a tutorial uh, basically a project inside that have a public static main method and this is a without public static main method class so this video is all about how you can install Eclipse ID and how you can create a Java project, how you can display the text on Eclipse ID using Java program. So I hope you are understood as well. Thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe my channel for getting updates. Have a nice day guys.